is a drainage project in Downers Grove and seepage in through the foundation that's coming up through the floor. So we're putting a drainage system all around the perimeter of the house to collect the water before it ever gets to the house. And then a lot of the water is coming from the front of the property over there and then flowing through here. So we're trying to catch it and then transport it to the back into a lower point. We're gonna be putting NDS Easy Flow all through here and putting in six inch catch basins to collect the water and speed it up to get it into the, it's basically an underground moat that's gonna go through there. And then we're gonna let it drain towards the low part of the property in the back there. And something else we're also gonna do is we're gonna add more additional drainage up in the foundation just to give it a little bit of, a little bit of extra areas to collect even more water. Excited today uh, should be the last leg of the drainage job, regrading of the yard, and the sod, new sod going down. You see the front of the property here, uh, a lot of dead grass, a lot of uneven soil, and the grass went up and down. So they put a drainage system in ground permeable. All our downspouts will feed right into it. All around the perimeter of the house, we had lots of flooding in the basement. Here on the south perimeter of our home, it, our property line goes up, as you see, and there was tons of boulders, trees, tree roots. They removed everything, regraded everything, and now we're going to put sod. They put the drain system all the way through the front of the yard, the side of the, the front of the house. On the south side of the home here, the on the perimeter, the water actually went back down to the foundation to get into the basement, so they regraded that as well. And then for the Brack property, we had dramatic and drastic dips that went about three and a half feet. And you see they regraded all of them. The sump pump and all the downspouts will feed right into the in-ground drainage system. Once upon a time last week before where landscaping started, the yard would come out about 10 feet and it would dip down about three and a half feet and we'd have a little pond or lake holding, you know, hundreds of gallons of water that would go back to the property in the foundation and flood the basement. So the drainage system they put right behind the house, they put a Y drainage system here to catch all the water when it comes down and it feeds out about 100, 120 feet. The garage once upon a time being last week when they started had a very drastic, it, it came out and then it dipped down about four, four and a half feet. So they regraded that too. So the yard aesthetically looks so much better. Five star improvement. The water will not go in the house again. Uh, the drainage system was needed and a crucial piece of keeping our home dry. And now the sod, some mulch, some cutting beds for flowers, trees, and bushes, and we're done. We could not be happier with where landscaping. Uh, two thumbs up, five stars. This is a day after some pretty significant rains. You can see the swale and the drainage system going through here. This is to collect all the water before it gets to the house. We used to get a lot of water into the basement and it was actually coming through the cracks in the middle of the floor. We tied in the downspouts and we put catch basins underneath them to filter out any leaves or debris. And then we put the drainage system all around the perimeter of the house, about seven to eight feet away from the house so it's a safe distance. And there was also a lot of water coming from the street up here. So we put in a Y system up here with some drains to collect it. We regraded, resodded everything back here. You can see the collection basins there at the low points. And then the swale continues through the backyard. We tied in more downspouts back here. We also tied in their sump pump so that the sump pump could discharge into the system. And there used to be a lot of saturation and sitting water through the back here. We leveled that out. And then we drained everything to the low point of the backyard. Everything's real dry. And all the water is getting away from the house and no more water in the basement.